Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. This is Glitch here today to play some more GTA 5. And it's kind of saddening and depressing that what happened is that I it took like five minutes to spawn in. I mean, that might be a normal time for like GTA 5. But when I did, Franklin just fell out of the sky like five feet. He scraped his ne legs and knees and he's just like, oh. And then he has to just rub himself all over this car to make him feel better. It's, it's like kissing it better, but like, you know, much, much better. But yeah, my ambulance for some reason is gone, and I'm very disappointed in that. But also I got a little text message thing here while I was standing, and it's like, Hey Franklin, we've been burning through supplies! Because that's kind of what they do. Um, and so what I'm gonna do is I think I might actually help the property. Because, I mean, I don't like to help my uh, thingamabobber. Who needs to help the taxi company? They should be able to figure out how to drive on their own. That's kind of their job, but... When it comes to, let's see, well, I'm actually pretty close. But yeah, like when it comes to people like, and their smoking habits, they probably don't even know what a car is. They're just like, whoa, man, this thing is like a motorized vehicle. I don't even know what a vehicle is, but it moves when you press on the pedal. What? And stuff like that. Oh man, that was, it's like the worst turn in the world. Or maybe the best, Franklin's just showing off. Showing off his inability to drive. But yeah, so they need Franklin's help for uh, learning how to drive. And that's why Franklin is going to come and save the day so then everybody can get more Mahawahanahan. It's it gets more intense each time you say it. Especially more so when oh man. This guy riding a bike? If so, I think he has is, is this guy really like a pedal bike? It looks like it is, but I, it can't... He can't be going that fast, can he? Ugh. <laughs> well, he's not riding it anymore. Oh, does he want to fight? I'll, I'll give him a nice fair fight. Ugh. That was fair. I just kicked him in the leg. <laughs> okay. I'll just, uh, don't mind me. This is... This is like a little race bike, isn't it? Yeah. Whipped, or whip it, whip it, whip it good. Got to get some Devo in here. But uh, let's see, where's the van? Is this something illegal that I'm going to be doing? That's that's the real question because I think I might be ste stealing this from the owner's house of Smoke on the Water. It, that's what it sort of sort of seems like. But prescription cannabis. See, so it's not illegal in that sense, but they probably sell it to people that aren't prescribed. Possibly. Okay, before time rolls out. This is like the perfect music to be playing while driving this thing. So I approve and I'm gonna keep it. But I wonder if I can't like run into things. So I mean, at least this isn't like bottles of beer. Not and on bottles of beer on the floor broken. Because that's, that's how bad it is for whenever Trevor drives. Franklin's not much better, but you know, it doesn't matter if he smashes this thing up. Still, because as I said before, they're all high whenever they drive this thing. And they're just like, oh yeah, that's just a, a big old teddy bear that went and it gave me a nice hug. Aww. And that's why, you know, they don't really care. And then afterward, when they're not high anymore, then they're just like, oh. Okay, so there's a lot of damage on our vehicle. Anybody know how this happened? And they're just like, no, no. I mean, I don't know anything about, uh still drugs and stuff, but I just assume that this is exactly how it works. This is this is the rundown, essentially. It makes sense, trust me. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> just hitting everything today. But I have an excuse. I'm a tired driver. Been driving for days, because Franklin, before this, he was... I don't think that... Because if you play on the same character for the longest amount of time, they don't get any sleep, if you think about it. So, I mean, or even food, for that matter. So he has, he's been running off of no sleep, no food, for the past, like, three or four days, and all he's been doing is just base jumping. So, I mean, that takes a big toll on him. I mean, I'm surprised that he hasn't been seeing hallucinations without even doing any of these uh, drugs here. I mean, that might actually make him sane again. At this rate, because this is... Oh boy, that's not very good. Franklin, how do you cope? Well, I guess he just has to survive. 
It's like The Sims. He doesn't have free will anymore. Oh no. I think I'm on the wrong side. Um... Yeah, sorry guys. Uh... I made a wrong turn, therefore you all die. Hopefully you weren't a potential customer and you were going to our rival companies. If you're going to our rivals, then I mean, that's that's perfectly fine if you get run over. Oh, I think this is... This is like Wade's place. Well, Wade's brother's place, that is, but... Or cousin. Uh, yeah. Saving. Yeah, we delivered. That's the way I do things. Woohoo! Or I should be going like... actually... Because <laughs> this is how uh, Franklin always has to celebrate. So, Ce like, celebrating weed... in and around... Oh, that was actually a really good flip. See, he could... <laughs> he looked kinda angry when he got up, he's just like, oh, Still, stop controlling me, man! I can't... I can't survive this much longer without any sleep or food... or anything man, of... these young cats is crazy! <laughs> Oh, please. No, that's normal. That's not crazy. I'll show you crazy. Um, and it's going to be... Oh, hey, not doing that. Right? that. But I noticed that there is the thing on the map now, finally. That it's up here. Um, Marianne. Did I already... I don't think that I've ever talked to this person before, or else, like, it wouldn't have the question mark with the F, so... That's a new Strangers and Freaks thing. But most importantly, I think I probably should go to the Dominator first, which I hear still, as I as I was saying with sleep and so on, Franklin, he really does need his sleep, so... It's gonna be a brand new day, I'm gonna go and, uh... Oh, do some Radio Gaga. Come on, oh no! Uh, I don't think that would be very delightful for either of us, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep going back and forth a little bit. Wait, he got back up again after that? That man, he is made out of hardened steel. Over time, he just doesn't care. About all the things in the world. Oh. I kind of meant to do that for the sole purpose that, like, this person's just sitting on the side of the road. Putting down their uh, nice convertible. Uh, do you mind if I just ride with you? Oh, no, you don't want it. <laughs> just, wait. Okay, this doesn't have turbo. I thought that it did. There's, that's what they should actually have for just various vehicles around. Is they need to actually have ones, like, some of them have turbo, some of them have, like, tinted windows or something like that, because there's probably somebody in the city who likes their whips. Yeah, those, those slang names for vehicles. But I mean, I guess you, you could have, like, a whip, like, from Indiana Jones, and you just, like, paint it colors, and you're just like, hey, look at my whip! And it's like, um, that's a literal whip. What are you talking about? We're, we're all the gangsters here, and you're not f abiding by our rules and regulations. Come on, man. So, yeah. There has to be somebody that just, like, has their all nice vehicles. Just like, go by, past the auto repair place. Okay, I am close to the right place for the house. Oh, <laughs> this is just a disaster. Oh, the humanity. This guy, like, whenever they find his vehicle again, they're going to need more insurance. Maybe that's why it's called Moore's Mutual Insurance, because, you know, you get... Sorry. It's a technicality. I, I can't move either, for that matter. Please don't try to hurt me. What's wrong? Okay, I'm... Uh, since the cops are gonna try to kill me, um... I think I'm just gonna have to run away in this general direction. To the golden toilet seat. What is that even supposed to be? Cov... Kovgari. It's, uh, the new Covenant, uh, recruits. They are all toilets now. Gold-plated toilets. That'd be a pretty interesting enemy to fight in Halo. I mean, makes sense. It's not, uh... What, what game was that? I want to say, like, Conquer or something like that. They probably had some sort of toilets. Makes sense. Okay, anybody around here? Oh, what's, what's going on here? Can I... Just want to sneak in. I don't think you can actually get in that. If I saw a garage door like that in real life, there's something seriously wrong with it, though, and, you know, you just have to, like, push it open or push it closed. 
That's not normal. It's not normal, man. Hmm. Okay, well, I'm almost there to go to sleep. The journey is pretty much over. Franklin, I know that it's midday. Let's see, what time is it? It's only one o'clock in the afternoon, but it's, it's time for you to take a bit of a nap. If not, a six-hour nap or whatever. So that's not actually not very much sleep. Like, the protagonists in this game, they get, like, nothing. It's just absolutely horrendous to their health. But, I mean, I guess they do a lot worse things for their health as well. Specifically anything dealing with Franklin. I mean, Trevor. But then again, Franklin. Oh, his, his health. So, uh, hmm. I still I don't have anything dealing with, uh, Mr. Dominator. I think I do need to just, like, keep playing the rest of the place. Hmm. I call shenanigans here. Or anything along those lines. Either way, I think that maybe I'll just keep, like, going through time and space. Still, that's that's the most, like, primitive form of time travel. Just going to sleep. Because if you think about it, whenever you go to sleep in real life, you wake up and you're at a different time. Oh, wow, the time just changed when he... <laughs> as soon as he hit the bed, the time actually changed, but... Yeah, uh, so that's, that's essentially what it is. Once you go to sleep, you time travel into the future. Into the morning. So, I mean, nobody wants to sit around and waste all their life all night long. Come on. Let's see what time is it. Oh, it's still so much morning. Okay. Franklin, you get a very, very long rest. You deserve it. Why well, don't sleep for 18 hours straight? <laughs> Pretty much. He gets up just to walk around a little bit, and like, okay, I'm gonna stretch my legs. Ugh, yeah. And then get back up again and stare at his health kit, which is so very useful to actually have that here. Oh, man. Hey, look at that. The one mission's on there again. So, strangers and freaks, here I come. I just need... To... Maybe I should just start phoning the taxi company before I even get outside, because... Unless I can get a helicopter or something. Helicopter. I wonder. Ah, that's too much work. It's too much work. Call a taxi for once. For once in my life, I mean, I don't, I don't help them out, but I mean, they can always help me. Yeah, yeah. Hey, wait, wait a second. Franklin has a lawnmower. I wonder if he ever does that thing. He doesn't really have much of a lawn. That's the thing. I guess he has a little bit in the back, but nah. Uh, oh, uh, I, I forget. I think you just press Y once. I always just want to do it like holding, just like on uh, GTA D4. Um, okay, there we go. You have to press sideways. I was pressing up and down. Everything that I know is backwards. Polito Forest. I'll get you there fast, buddy. Did he just say Polito Forest? I would like you to take me out into the middle of nowhere, in the forest, and uh, have your way with me, please. This is why I uh, phoned you specifically. That's probably why people say, like, yeah, I want Franklin as the driver for my... Uh, Taxi men, because, uh, yeah. I, I want to have my way with him. Hmm. Oh, Franklin. You're the more than one way the best at being a taxi driver. If you want to call me a taxi for some reason. <laughs> that's, that's a weird, weird thing. Well, actually, I don't have a pistol that actually is just a, has a silencer, because I wanted to shoot some birds. I want you to shoot some birds out of the sky. Or I could just do this. Um, I really hope... Yeah, Target practice! Because they always say that Franklin needs to practice his shooting. Well... I just want to see... <laughs> the birds falling from the sky. If only it could actually, like, land on top of my head or something like that. So it would be looking hilarious. Even more hilarious than that. Uh, this might take a little while for swimming. But you know what? At least I still have my knife in my hand, I think. So whenever you go swimming, make sure you carry a knife. You never know when you might get attacked, or you might want to use it as a paddle. Or you might want to stab yourself accidentally and uh, bleed out while attracting a ton of sharks to you. So I mean, if you ever want to attract sharks, oh man, carry a knife. They can smell the fear on your ha hands. Ha ha hands. Wait, wait, what's going on here? Also, is this just a dog? Oh, okay, I think it is. 
Oh, I think this is a different kind of dog. I want to see, because they all look like Chop generally. But I think this is a different one. Oh, wow. Is this... You got this. Oh, no. I think it's this woman. Focus. She's only ever met... 69, 70. Stop looking at my ass. I wasn't looking oh, no. at your ass. I know. Franklin's going to no know the pain now. Does. A little thin for my taste. But nice. What are you going for a swim? What do you care? You think I got a fat ass what? and I only swim because I float easily? I was just making conversation. I'm doing a three way. A what? A triathlon. Sounds like you got way too much I'm time. I'm pretty on sure your you own. don't call F that a three way. You're like a stay at home cheerleader, do you? Pathetic. You know what? F you, bitch. I'll beat you. Come on. I promise. <laughs> I bet you like to beat women. I wonder uh, why your ass is single. Yeah. That's not very polite. Franklin is a very classy man. But I just love that I just jumped like over top of her. We were playing Leapfrog. But still, like. Well. I think he was a little bit, but. Not because uh, he wanted to, but because she made him. I'm not even feeling it. Man, I'm really feeling it. I really ain't dressed. I didn't know the shelf was around here. <laughs> oh yeah, Franklin's wearing way too many layers to be like swimming because he's he has his like classic, this like repo business kind of uh, clothing here. Has like three different. Damn. Shirts on stuff. Mommy's not here. See, she. I think she is. Like, I. I wanted to go into see Dom. Like, as you know, the Dominator and stuff. But I mean, she's more of the Dominator now. Oh man. It's, oh, did I just run over a seagull? I didn't even know that was possible, but. I guess that probably, like, if you ran over a seagull, like, if you ran over... I don't know. <laughs> it probably would kill it, let's just say that. But... This is so terrible! That poor little seagull, I mean, at least if it was, like, bullets, then... That's fine, but... Oh man, she's not very quick. What's the last bit of a triathlon? I guess running, yeah. I was just wondering for a second there. But yeah, I guess that you can still lean down. Just, that's... Watch the damn road! That's a little bit of a tip for anybody that wants to know. So you can- oh no! Um... No! Oh, I think this is not gonna end well. Oh no! Ah! <laughs> I couldn't make it! How- No, that's- What the hell are you talking about? Yeah, I don't know what it. What is a taper? Isn't a taper like a kind of animal? You out of your fucking mind? The first I knew about this was seeing your skinny ass on the beach. Oh, I'm just gonna keep going. I got I got to the checkpoint before you though. Can I punch her? I really want to punch her, but I don't think I'll be able to uh, live with myself. I would never be able to live with myself if I actually hit her, even though she's a crazy woman that. Probably still is going to hold a knife to my throat after. 175 is... Actually, no, that's that's probably normal. I was thinking that's maybe a little bit unhealthy, but if you're running and just, like, going crazy, I'd say so. But, yeah, Franklin, I think, might be the fastest runner, actually, out of everybody. He seems faster than uh, Michael, at least. Michael has the, the fat, like, non-stop power running, though. You can't stop him. If he starts running... Hey, <laughs> See, like, I won't I won't hit her, but I mean... If it's a random jogger that's next to me... I, I have to. I just can't help it. <laughs> well, great, you won! Aren't you gonna gloat? Look, we both survived. These things are about taking part, not winning, right? No, it is always about winning! All right. I gotta keep going. Some loser. Fat, unmarried, career-driven loser! Hey, girl, you better chill the fuck out! Go to hell! Wow. And now I have a contact which, like... Oh, I got gold! Just for, like, winning, I guess. 
I thought that I had to win each individual, like, section. Because I, I lost the bike race, kind of, because of, uh, mistakes were made, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa! There's a weapon up here! I don't know what that was, but... It's probably good. I have a feeling the, la the last bit with, like, Marianne is probably going to be her versus Trevor, and then they're gonna get married. Because they're just like, oh, we're both so crazy! And then, uh, yeah. But he's gonna lose to her, and she's gonna like, yes! I love you so very much, and then they just like stare into each other's eyes, and they have like the ba da 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 da, ba da 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 da, you know that kind of thing. Okay, so that doesn't actually break the bench. I really want to just test that out. Also, I want to test this out best way possible. Sticky bombs. Just gonna put a couple on here. Do do, and then I'm going to. Walk away very slowly. Oh! Wait, it actually did blow up! That was awesome! Totally worth those three sticky bombs. You can't fire through it, at least with a little tiny SMG. Maybe with, like, a... Uh, grenade launcher. Hey, wait, I have RPGs with him. Don't remember getting them, but... And also, I have a musket. That's the most important thing. I'm just gonna keep a musket out. What was that? I don't know. Oh, well. What's going on down here? Oh, that guy's just starting to drive away. He knows what's gonna be happening to him if he doesn't. This is like an impromptu race or something. Come on! I'm gonna catch up to them. Chase him down. I don't know about anybody else, but like... Back when I used to play like GTA 4 a ton, like, I used to play this one game. Where I just target an NPC and just like chase them down. And just keep ramming them until uh, they just like submit to my authority. Wah! <laughs> I mean, not quite like this because I mean, they just fall off their bikes and actually died. That's really terrible. But uh, what I would always do is you just. It's probably somebody with an SUV because I mean, you just keep ramming them until they try to explode. Because that's, that's what I like to do. Oh, yeah. But anyway, anyway, um, there is like only one other mission currently on the objective, objectifier, because there's the FIB thing, because I think that maybe if I just do like another mission and just like get through the story a little bit more, then I can do the final thing with Dom, or something like that, I'm not entirely sure. Or maybe like you actually unlock more of these things once uh, you, it says 12 now, didn't I have 12 before? I think I probably did. Ah, uh, that's like a million. A million and two. But, yeah, I'm going to go over there. It says with Franklin to start with. Maybe I should actually start with Franklin. How's the easiest way of getting there, though? Maybe if I just take my time and drive on the road. Drive on the highway. Or I could just phone uh, a taxi again. And then just say, hey, I'm out in the middle of the forest again. Even though this isn't quite the forest, but that's that's what you guys call it for some strange reason. Also, I just thought of that now. Is it like, how come, like, you know, Marianne, she has, like, a contact picture and stuff like that, even though... And also, she didn't really give me her number or anything like that. I just, like, talked to her and just, like, I have her as a contact. It's just... But when you didn't really see anything... It's just like, the screen blacked out for a second, and they just like, uh, went and exchanged uh, contact information, and they took pictures of each other, just like, okay, this is the best picture that I want. You'd oh no, I don't want to phone her. <laughs> I wanted to phone, uh, the Capsi Company. Capsi Company, yes. Makes sense. Hey, can I get a cab? On its way, sir. But, Thanks for calling. that's what Sounds they do. Good. They're just taking several photos of each other, have a big old photo shoot, and see what there is to see. Partially, some of those were naked, of course. I mean, that just goes without saying. Because, I mean, she was saying, like, Oh, you were looking at me! You were looking at me! And it's like, well, now I am, because we're kind of having a photo shoot for some strange reason. Hmm. Strange how this works out. It seems the taxi isn't coming yet again. It's always, it always seems to happen when I'm on the highway. So, I think I'm just gonna drive all the way there, using this little ATV. I mean, originally, it was like Franklin was gonna be driving there on a bike, the bike may or may not have transformed into uh, a quad, but it's still a quad bike. 
you can count that as part of the name. Come on, guys. Oh, what's this? I gotta go. What? What's happening? Is this woman like dying in in need of like hospital repair? Okay, yeah. Take it easy. I got you. <laughs> I just have blood all over my hands. There's gotta be a hospital near here somewhere. No, no hospitals. Can you take me to Sandy Shores? I got people there who can help me out. Chola Springs Avenue. Is this like Trevor or something like that? Another 20 seconds, I'd have had the cops all over me. What the hell happened back there? Okay. Don't worry about it, okay? It's not worth it. Can you get on the back of a quad? now. You won't go to the hospital or the cops. And you're fleeing the scene of a dead body. If you want my help, you're gonna have to do better than that. Come on, man. Those can't be your only wheels. Help me out here. Well, those... I don't know what this voice actor makes me think of, but... She sounds familiar. I want to be clear what I'm getting into. So you're in the game? Now who's asking too many questions? <sighs> Look, we hit a pawn shop, okay? But it was a sting. Cops were waiting for us. Supposed to be an easy job, low risk, 20k each. I was the driver. And not and, very good. Oh wow, yeah. If, if hey, you're upside I down. Got three roadblocks. We had half a San Andreas law enforcement on our ass. We'd have been home free if that son of a bitch hadn't pulled a blade on me at 100 miles per hour, spun us off the road. You cross me, I put you down. <sighs> no second chances. Sounds like you need to find a better crew. Considering I got two in custody and the other one dead on the side of Sonora Freeway. I need any crew, period. Why? You know so much? Whoa, no, what's... Say that. The one guy was just, like, going crazy. I wanted to go and hit him, because... No no hmm, whatever. Left all the money. Way too hot to wash. I'll get myself patched up. Lie low at the safe house for a day or two. Then see what I can put together. Damn. I don't feel my leg so good. I got my foot down. Ain't a lot more I could do. Oh, so am I supposed to be going there fast or something? Or else, like... She is bleeding out. She's going to die. Oh no. But like, for her voice as well, like, she doesn't... She looks pretty old when just like, Franklin is picking her up there. Maybe it's because of just like... If she's from Sandy Shores, she's probably like, doing meth and all that, so... That ages ya. Quite a bit. Be cool, I'll get you there. Yeah, but also like, I have a feeling this is... Basically an intro, just like, yeah, so uh... Do you want to be a part of our crew? You can uh, be a gunner or something. Or actually, no, she'd be a driver probably if she's like, she's the getaway driver. Which I might actually need one of those if I can't use uh, Franklin again. Not like this. Come on, not like this. I'm gonna get you there as fast as I can. Pretty much there. And also, what would help like for being there just like a couple seconds earlier? Either you're gonna bleed out here or you're gonna bleed out out there probably. Unless you have just, like, a lot of medical equipment and stuff right here. I don't know. Who knows? It. Listen, I ain't sure what you're into, but if you need a driver anytime, you let me know. Hmm. But I don't... It just seems weird when you're just saying it that way, though. Oh, heist crew member Taliana Martinez unlocked. I think that's, like, Taliana. That's probably the right way of saying it. Because if it's anything like that for Martinez, it has to be something like very special of a name. It can't just be a regular one that's just like boring, just like uh, Martina. It has to be Martiana and so on. Where's my... I think this might be the right gas station. Yeah. Just coming here to get some gas. Don't mind me. This one's filled, right? This jerry can? Wait, do I already have one? Oh, I think I just picked it up. I was just checking. Ah, oh, nice. I think maybe I did have one, I just didn't have it completely full. But yeah, now if my uh, vehicle runs out of gas, I can go. Which... Like, that's the one thing everybody always says, like, yeah, they're gonna add that to GTA at some point. Just like, you have to add in gas. That would not be a good thing. Just saying, that would be bad. So it'd be so annoying, but at least if you had, like, a jerry can, it wouldn't be as terrible, but... It's like, oh no, I'm getting chased by the cops. What do I do? 
I have to fill up my tank. Just, just wait, guys. Please don't shoot either, because I might explode. And that would not be very uh, happy, to say the least. 